Today, we're going to be adding the two bedrooms and the main bathroom to the ultimate vacation yacht. Let's get started. So we kind of already have these rooms like actually um built kind of like the blueprint. Of course, we're going to add more, but now we need to actually like paint the walls. So that is important. And this little desk right here, we're going to go ahead and turn on symmetry. But all right, for this wall right here, we're going to make it that light gray color. So it's a little bit of a different tone than that one. And then we got this main wall kind of right here. And I think we're going to fill this wall with like that golden color. Kind of looks like brown. I don't know. Gold will work though for that. And then what color should this table right here be? We can maybe have it be like a dark gray i feel like that would look good okay we're gonna do that and then any leds in this room of course somewhere but before we do any of that let's actually add some windows so right here's the window over here we're just gonna line it up and this is where the bottom of the window was at and then it can go up an additional block so right there we can have like a window of some sort let's grab our window here on our menu let's do a um nope we want a two by two so this is a two by two right here we're just gonna put a window right there and then to add some more design to it we'll put a singular um one by two there so all right that does let's actually kind of make like the seal for um how we did in the other one so right here is that thing and then right there it goes up by two we're gonna make them white just for the um outside color then on the interior side we're gonna make it a little bit of a darker tone so we'll make like a fairly dark tone right here just like that perfect so now we have like kind of some windows going on there amazing and then i did completely forget about this wall right here so for this wall we're gonna grab our custom brown color we made right there and we're going to put it on this wall right here so i feel like that would look good it kind of like goes with that golden one i don't know it'll look fine but all right now we have these beds in here we're gonna make the um actual like kind of frames of these completely brown so like you know the edging here the actual um wooden post stuff the things that you would think that would be wood in real life and then we're just gonna do that fill it down here add all the details there we go and then for the staircase here or ladder i should say we're gonna make it that light gray color and then fill that in perfect all right it's kind of looking decent in here i kind of want to change this should we have it be brown for that too um but you know we'll probably just keep it white honestly white looks pretty good for that and then for the color of the bed of course we're gonna do this red color right here so some Something like that kind of looks like a minecraft bed but honestly that looks good too and same with the beds over here so should we keep the pillow white what other color should we have it definitely not that oh we have like the covers right here too yeah i think we'll just keep it like that that honestly looks good but to add some more design to it we're gonna make it that peach color right there same with these over here so just the pillow would be that peach part there we go perfect and then for the led side of things in this room we're gonna delete this entire wall here which actually probably deletes that painting there oh i don't think we can do that then um how should we do these leds something we could do um we're on the right room right now we could delete both of those and just have it go straight down there that would not get in the way of the painting and then we could maybe do another row can we do another row oh nope i don't think we can do that maybe if we continue having it like go over here no nope. okay i think we can just do one row like that that will work so let's grab ourselves some paintable indicators actually you know what just to make this easier on ourselves we're just going to copy the ones over here so for this we're just going to put it right here all right that will work and then we need to change the color of all of it so we're going to do replace color and make it this like kind of um a gray color we're doing for the wall so something like that all right great now we have to copy that over to this other side over here because it's looking um a little plain there we go we got both rooms looking very nice i can say that um i want to add something right here but we can't because of the painting oh look at the back oh that's terrible okay we need to paint this up but yeah i don't really think we can do any more on this wall we can do some more on this wall here so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna do let's grab ourselves another paintable indicator put it right here we're gonna make it white just so like the outside of the boat remains unaffected and we'll have it go right here and then it'll also continue going Going down so right here on this lower part it'll continue to glow um we'll make it like kind of dip down there and then at the end here we will have it curve up pretty nicely just like that all right i feel like that worked pretty well we're gonna paint the inside of this we don't want that messed up and i think the outside looks um decently fine all right so for these we're gonna replace the color to the gray of the wall and then we're gonna do white once again of course in the future here we will probably change the color of all the whites or most of them at least i don't know white also just still really looks good for this so i think we might keep it i don't know okay so we're gonna make this white right here so it'll just line down the wall that's fine if we do it like that because we're gonna have it be too thick anyways all right so right here is where it gets it's interesting we have to turn off this like grid line thing okay we're gonna do that and then we'll have a keep going down let's see it'll just go down like that so like a block every time oh we don't want it to go that far down uh, maybe we should kind of level it out here something like that no that's kind of like too much though but yeah there we go something like that would look um decent i don't know if i really like that um can we do anything to like kind of fix it um maybe that no that's too much okay all right well we're gonna keep it like that even though it looks a little bit um blocky you can say so we're just gonna copy all of this and put it on the other side and then i'm kind of thinking right here looks a little plain we should maybe have it um go all the way up and connect so we're going to make it white once again and something like that will work and we're just going to drag this down oh we don't have it on that mode there we go but all right yeah i'm really liking the design in this room here we definitely need to add some like stuff on the table there maybe a actual chair to sit down in and something maybe a carpet right here that'd work maybe 
All right, so we got the custom made carpet right here. It is from the Ikea prop pack or whatever. Um, Where should we put this at? Maybe we could put it like right in front of the bed or in front of the doors to like clean off your feet. I don't know. We'll probably just do that. We'll put it right in front of the door to like clean off your feet. Make sure you don't get any sand inside the boat. That'd be really bad, especially your bed. Oh, that suck. Okay, we're going to put that right there. Amazing. So now we got a nice carpet and I feel like the carpet would look much nicer if we had it be white. Okay, so we're just going to do white for the carpet here. Hopefully I don't regret that. There we go. All right. I feel like that would definitely work. It adds like more modern to the room and I have to go bring this all the way over here. And I also brought over this, um, what you call it, like a lantern light thing. Okay, so we're going to put this on the desk because I was looking for stuff to actually put on the desk and this looks pretty good. So we're just going to slap this in here somewhere. All right, so let's put it right on the desk. Should we put it in like right there? Would that be a good spot? Nope, Um, right there would work. Okay, we're going to do right there on that side and then we have to do probably something the exact same on the other side. So we'll click K twice and maybe put it there. Was that how it was? Yep, I think so. So we're going to paste it in and merge both in. I think we got that one. Nope. Okay, perfect. And then up here in the bedroom, we're going to make like a little bit of a storage stand right there. So there we go. You can put some stuff on there. Should we just keep that white? I think we will. Let me know in the comments if we should change that though to whatever color you want. But of course, we cannot forget about some equipment in this room. So we're going to grab some storage areas. And down here, you can put like personal items, like some other like storage equipment stuff. And then in the center here, we're just going to block it off. So in here, you can put a fire extinguisher or whatever. Matter of fact, we need fire extinguishers in this thing. Okay, so we need a fire extinguisher we'll put one right here for this so fire extinguisher we definitely need another one i would think so we're going to probably put a couple more matter of fact we need a fire extinguisher for every room that is a new law so what we're going to do where should we put one in here there's a whole bunch of room on this wall right here maybe that but i don't know i feel like we need to add something like cool there here we'll add the fire extinguisher like maybe right here would this be oh wait no that's the painting oh no we can't do that a stupid painting is always in the way all right so fire extinguisher in here will probably be perfectly right there outside of our door or I mean inside so we'll put it like that and color these walls up it's already perfect all right amazing and the main hallway here needs a fire extinguisher of course so we're going to let's see delete a couple blocks like right here is that fine I think we'll I think we'll survive so we're just gonna put another one right here and we should probably start on the bathroom now so right here's the main actual bathroom of the boat we're gonna try fitting a walk-in shower a toilet and a sink um that might not work oh my gosh I forgot how little of a space we're working with kind of but we will try Try. So let's see. Um, it definitely needs a sink. So everything like pretty large has to be over here. So let's start with the walk-in shower. So let's see. Let's grab ourselves some windows here. And these windows will be, um, you know, to block off the walk-in shower. So we'll probably have it be something like that. So this is our walk-in shower right here. Pretty tall. I forgot how tall this actual bathroom is. But yep, walk-in shower is right there. It's not done yet, though. We need to add a little bit more to it. So one by threes will be on that side of it. So just a little bit larger. And there we go. Walk-in shower. I don't know if we can fit in there i hope we can though but anyways on this side i think we're going to actually um add the toilet here so we're going to grab ourselves um the gold toilet color oh we already got our gold out here forgot one block off the ground toilet that's fine with me so we have to extend it right there and make it all pure gold here and there we go we kind of got the toilet but of course we cannot forget to actually add like the edging under here that um evens it out on the bottom we can't just have it float here you'd be um using the bathroom all over the actual floor we really don't want that in our yacht here this is supposed to be a very nice luxury yacht so we're going to put that there. Amazing. So now we have a working functional toilet kind. Not really, but uh, it's a toilet. All right. So now we need room for a sink. This is the um, hard part. We could just use this as a sink, you know, just flush it. And then we got some fresh water in there. That would work. But, um, you know, I don't really know. Okay. So let's see. We could extend the bathroom over here if we wanted to, but I, no, that's the washing machine area. We can't do that. All right. So for the sink here, we're going to extend it one block. I really hope this isn't too much here. So we're going to do that. And it is too much because we can't even get in the shower if we do that. So if we want to still enter the shower we'll have to block that off okay that's really rough okay so we'll just line it up with the sink so this is the sink right here um it is fairly large but i mean it's a it's a sink there we go um let's kind of start with the plumbing on it here so block it off completely right here and you know of course do our thing and even it out but all right for the sink um wall right there we're gonna do that dark gray and then for the um just normal color here we'll do a pretty light gray for the um sink. so let's go ahead and grab an exhaust pipe and these exhausts nope we want the exhaust manifold actually so this thing right here kind of looks like an exhaust or um what do you call it a faucet so we'll put two faucets right here should we do one or two um two you know it's a little bit different and to add some more color in the actual bathroom here we're gonna paint this wall like this peach color i don't know why i feel like it just looks good like that so we're going to paint it down there and then maybe um also this front wall here for the just a shower area we'll just make this entire shower area like the peach color um i don't know why waterproofing maybe all right so now we need a light um probably last thing for the bathroom maybe we need to add some leds in it leds seem like a little bit too 
too much for the bathroom. We'll just put this here, color that, and then um, outside color will be white. Perfect. And now we need to make a button in there for a light. So we will grab that. Sorry, but scratch everything I just did in here. That looks actually terrible. I just like kind of spawned it in and looked at it. No, we are not doing that. That looks like so weird with all the other colors in here. And white also doesn't look too like thrilling either. Honestly, I don't even know what to do at that point with it. We're just going to do that for now. But anyways, now we need a button for the bathroom. We're going to put the button right here and it'll be facing. Nope. Other way how we had it. And this will connect to that light right there. And I think it is all clear from here. Yep. Let's spawn it in and look at it. All right. Bathroom is right here. We have the light and we can walk in the shower. Oh, we can't actually walk over there. Guys, I don't know what to do about that part. Um, never mind. I do. So we can actually extend the window a little bit here. All right. So I just moved it like a centimeter over and now we can go on it. Perfect. Amazing. And we got our toilet here. I, I need to make a gold in the end. I forgot about that, but um, in here it's looking nice. In the bedrooms, it is also looking nice. We need to um connect an LED like actual button for that also. So why don't we go ahead and do that? So where should our button actually be in here? Um, oh, perfect spot actually right here on the entrance wall. So we'll just put it right here, and this will activate. Oh, that's not the actual same color. Now it should be just like that. And now we need to connect all this stuff. Oh my gosh! All right, 20 minutes later, we got that done. Let's go ahead and spawn this in, or it's already spawned in. But there we go. We got a nice looking LED strip there. There is nothing on that wall right there. We need to do something with that. And I'm kind of thinking on this wall here that has nothing on it, we could kind of make like the Neotastic logo on it. That sounds like a very good idea. So we're going to do, um, let's see, how many blocks is this? We're going to do one, two, three up each time. So we're going to do one, two, three, one, two, three. Yep, we're going to do this a couple times. All right, so we can have it probably go up about that high and then we'll have it kind of even out here and then it will continue kind of like going down like how we had it. So, you know, it's like a really curved end and then we're going to have it go back up. All right, so at this exact point, right here we're going to do how many did we do there three okay we're gonna do three and then just keep going up that's all we got to do look at that it's already kind of coming together it looks pretty good and there we go we just reached the top so there it is neotastics and it kind of looks like a stock market if i'm not gonna lie um very interesting but it looks cool so i'm kind of wondering if i should fill it up so like do maybe two on each one i think that would look good but should we do like an outer glow with like a white would that be too much i feel like that might be too much um maybe that actually looks really cool okay so we're probably going to put this all over the boat. Um, let's go ahead and copy this. It won't look like exactly how reflective it looks right now. It's a little bit bright, if I'm be honest. Um, hopefully it doesn't at least. So we're just going to put this in a couple locations. So we'll put it like right here. Oh, that looks just so nice. Just looks like a whole bunch of um, wavy lines kind of. All right. So as you can see, there's nothing on the wall right here. But when we turn this light on, oh, there it is. The Neotastic logo. That actually looks so cool. OK, we're definitely going to keep that there. And then just for the bathroom here, we're going to make a bamboo stick or at least what I want people to kind of think of it or a cactus or whatever you really think that is um that it just looks like it's supposed to be there you know and we're also going to put the neotastic logo i think out here or like like right here in the staircase when you walk down we'll put like a big neotastic sign Ooh, that looks really cool maybe a little bit lower okay maybe that um is that a good height it'll work for now okay we're just going to put this here and then merge it in and there we go oh i forgot about the different colors and probably back here too yeah that's really bad actually bad enough that it got rid of the wall for the actual um bathroom you know what we're just going to delete that and slide it over one block okay one block will work maybe another one um i don't know i kind of want it to be visible for everyone so i'll put it right there and then i also think i found the perfect spot for it right here wait is it perfect one two three four one two three oh it'd be uneven oh we can't do that i forgot i made a very uneven painting here yeah that's pretty unfortunate maybe i should make it a little larger um i don't know guys i don't really want to make another one of those okay we'll just leave it like that for now we'll put something there then this wall right here looks like it needs some decoration on it i have just the perfect idea you know i'm just like really good at this interior stuff guys okay so we're gonna put this neotastic branding sign right here oh this is some really good branding going on in this thing i can tell you that okay we'll slam this right here in the wall and put it right here visible to a lot of the people in the bar perfectly centered on the wall also merge it there and now we have to change all the color even outside of the boat you can see the big neotastic thing oh that's so awesome we need to put one on the outside uh we'll probably do that on an exterior video because we have a whole bunch of stuff we actually need to add out here like uh hot tub maybe yeah a lot of you guys have been saying that and you know what just to keep these always on no matter what happens unless you like hit a breaker switch or that you know that'll turn off um we're gonna connect a constant on signal so they will always remain on you will not be able to turn those off that is not happening absolutely not so we're gonna connect a constant on to a lot of all right so we walk down our nice stairs right here we got a big neotastic branding sign right there amazing um we go in our bedroom here neotastic we go over here neotastic oh my gosh so yeah we got our party zone out here looking very very nice that's actually way too many um lights right here did i really add that many lights hold on wait what why is there so many um 
two main lights in here actually three and then that all right we're kind of working on this area over here all right so we need a washing machine which i do have so we're gonna go ahead and grab a washing machine by the way this is the washing machine i'm using if you want to go get it off workshop very cool little thing so we're just going to drag this down here i wonder if it's a one-to-one -one washing machine probably okay we're just gonna drag i don't want to back it up one block you know what we can't do that it's made for the spot actually we're gonna rise it off the ground here just like you know reasons so we're gonna rise it off the ground and then fill it up down here with like some block maybe like wood you know wood would look good just kind of holding up a washing machine maybe i don't know we'll just do something like that for now perfect and then just to make it look a little bit more modern we'll line this up to the ceiling right here and then we're going to make it go across there we go i really do not know what to do under these stairs here we could maybe add a couch if it's only two blocks nope wait this is actually two blocks wait we could fit a couch right there um should we do that i don't know you know we'll just put it there kind of see how it looks i don't know what else we would put here maybe uh an access hatch to the logic room um that might be necessary but we could also do that up here which um would also be better probably and we could put one right here so yeah we're just gonna fill that up with couches back there we don't need anything else important so we're just going to go ahead and copy this as simple as that all right we're gonna just drag this right where our stairs are at bring it up one block and ooh, that's perfect um that would work though i feel like there's just too much room back here we'll just put it there for now honestly what else would we put there uh just for now though if i figure out anything to put back here we'll definitely do that so yeah guys that's probably going to be it for this video of course i will add some more stuff here off screen make it look much nicer it's looking a bit plain in here but i just can't think of anything right now that we would add um the bedrooms are looking very nice though we got some working lights in here i still have to add some like actual ceiling lights but it's looking very nice in here i just love that neotastic logo but make sure you guys like and subscribe hit that bell join the discord link is in the description but thanks for watching and goodbye